Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to DC Universe Online. I'm, of course, Trex, and today we're going to be looking at the Sacred Weapon Pack style coming on the Marketplace. So you can see, you can get them on the, play, on the PlayStation for 500 loyalty points and on the PC for 500 station cash. Now, this right here is the opposite of the Wicked Pack, where Wicked, you could say, represented evil. Let's see what the good looks like. So here we are with the Sacred Sword. This is for the one-handers out there. This is now, instead of having a purple outline or even that black, uh, the black translucent with the blade, we now have this light fixture where, I'm sorry, this sword looks like something from from out of Legends of Zelda. Just, just what it really represents to me. Just something from Legends of Zelda. And I love it. There's, I have no problem with it. Has that like Phoenix crest where the blade is. It's nice. Next up is the Sacred Great Axe for the two-handers out there. So, with this, this is once a giant blade. Now, this is something that the Wicked style could have probably gone with. Instead of that two-handed blade that felt like maybe just a giant one-hander, this is a two-handed great axe. This thing looks uh, light of justice. Now, with the blades that we're seeing, it looks like it has like a phoenix effect with it that I'm really, really enjoying. I'm going to keep repeating that, too. <coughs> Next up is the bow. The bow is pretty much looks like your standard bow, but of course it has it's what it's the style pack for it. Uh, at the ends where you would see normally the uh, the string for the bow, that's where you see the black with the phoenix feather looking effect. Uh, then of course the middle of it has that great shininess of from for a sacred light look. It's a really uh, classic looking bow with a new style. Next up is the sacred blades for the. Dual wielders out there. These are like if you were a ninja, and these are like sick little uh, little uh, kunai knives. That's pretty much how I'm going to treat them as. But I mean, they're just like these little dagger-looking things that it's pure sacred light that you're holding in your hands. That I'm seriously loving the blade style, where it looks like a phoenix feather. I'm going to keep repeating it. It's a it looks like a phoenix feather. I'm going to keep repeating it because you guys love it. You know you do. Next weapon. We have Brawling. This is a uh, Sacred Cestus for you brawlers out there. This is now... the We saw the Wicked style have... It was right there on the back of the palm, on your hand. And this Sacred style is that blade pointing out further than the Wicked. I love that blade pointing out. Again, if it was just a little bit bigger, I would be... I would love it even more, but I, I still love the style for you brawlers out there. I think you guys are really going to enjoy it. Next up is blasters. This is your this is for the hand blasters. Look, it's just like the smaller version. That's all it is. <coughs> just a smaller version of it, and it still looks really nice, really cool. The blade sticks out a little bit. You got that uh, the actual phoenix feathers where the blade uh, the blackness of it is. It's sticking out more onto the side, so you still get to see your glove style. You still get to see it. Next is the sacred pistols. Um, I want to say the bullets are actually, uh, it's like they, you have your gun and then the blades underneath the barrels. That's basically the style for it. So you're, you're really using it as a blade. All right. I mean, you got the blade, that blade, uh, those blade feathers underneath the barrel of the gun. Uh, I like this one a lot better than the, than the wicked style. I will say that. Next up is the sacred rifle. Where, yes, the bl it, the blade sticks out a little bit further uh, from the barrel, and <coughs> I like it. Uh, this is this is definitely a rifle style that I would uh, that I can have a little bit more enjoyment with because of that because it does have that blade style look to it. Uh, the blade that blade protruding out like uh, I can't think of a sword underneath it. My God, the sword actually escapes me, but it still looks really nice. It does. <coughs> Next is the Sacred Staff. I, I, what am I supposed to say? I, it's the blade. The blades are making me, are just, re, I'm really enjoying this. These are what I'm really happy with, is the blade style with uh, with this, uh, with these things. It really is. Ah, oh, man, it's just, oh, that, it feels like the Phoenix Force. Do you even feel like an X-Men right about now? I'm just telling you, it just feels great. Next up is the barrier. Once again, winning. Just winning. 
with these shields. Love the shield. This is something that makes me feel like Legend of Zelda now. Just makes me, just ha I just have that feel. Just have those Legend of Zelda feels. So, once again, you shield users, I believe you guys got the best weapon style out of these packs. Out of Sacred and Wicked. So, let's look at the next weapon. Next weapon is the Martial Arts. It's for the Sacred Guitars. <coughs> these. These are beast. I can't believe I actually said beast. These are nice. These are just... You, of course, you are holding on to the middle of them, but they are just like some great light daggers that you're just holding in your hands that uh, I really do like that uh, aspect for it. It almost feels like you could wear them almost as a glove and just go with it. Almost something that Brawling could have used. But anyways, that was your sacred weapon style. You can pick them up on the marketplace. Uh, thank you all so much for watching, and I hope you guys did enjoy it. And I do apologize about the cough. Still getting over a little bit of the uh, of a cold away, I guess you want to call it. But I had to get video, I had to get videos out. You never know. Thank you all so much for watching. I'll see you guys next time.